Okay, so here I am back with my current limiting and short circuit protection circuit. And now I have figured out that all you need is one transistor. One resistor and one transistor. Here we see a normal transistor. Uh, it's a BD547. It's an NPN transistor. And then we have a resistor going from the power supply, which is a battery, from the power supply through a 47K resistor to the base of the transistor. And then from the emitter of the transistor we take we are connected to ground and then the power for the LED is coming from the battery through the meter back through the meter through the LED and goes to the collector of the transistor there is no resistor to limit the current through this LED. The current is limited by the transistor because the transistor amplifies the current it gets through the resistor, which is pretty big. So the transistor only gets a few microamps to the base and then it only lets 16 milliamps through the LED. So you have eliminated the need for a current limiting transistor. And also this red wire is connected to uh, the collector, directly, directly to the collector. So if I take this and I touch it here directly to the power and making a short circuit across the LED, the LED will turn off and the circuit still only draws 16 milliamps because the transistor is still limiting the current that can flow through it. And so it protects against short circuit as well. It's very useful, very simple and very useful. Okay, that's all. Bye-bye.